Example number 2 for spiral curve. A spiral, 75 meter long, connects a tangent with the 6 degrees and 45 minutes circular curve. Okay? If the stationing of the TS is 5,000 and the gauge of the track on the curve is 1.75 meters, determine the following. Letter A, the elevation of the outer rail at the midpoint if the velocity of the fastest train to pass over the curve is 50 km per hour. Letter B, the spiral angle at the first quarter point. Letter C, the deflection angle at the end point. And letter D, the offset from the tangent at the second quarter point. Okay, so, meron tayong ano, a given LC, which is equal to 75 meters, or yung length of spiral. Okay, then meron naman tayong given a degree ng circular curve, that is DC, which is equal to uh, 6 degrees and 45 minutes. Okay, Ayan. then meron tayong ano, a gauge para doon sa track ng curve. Okay, so that is ano, um, one, yung letter B. Okay, doon sa ating super elevation. That is 1.75 meters. Ayan. So, ang pinapahanap, elevation daw nung outer rail. So, ang hinahanap sa letter A is yung letter E. Sa ating super elevation. Okay? Ito yung hinahanap. Ayan. Okay, then meron naman tayong speed. Okay, wala tayong sinabing ano, frictional force. Okay? So, um... Kung wala tayong frictional force, ibig sabihin, zero yun. Okay? Sabihin, wala siyang coefficient of friction. So, alalahan natin yung uh, super elevation natin na small e is equals to what? Uh, that is, ano, actually, that is what? Uh, coefficient of friction plus e is equals to v squared over kilometer per hour. That is 3.6 squared multiplied by gr. Okay? So, ito nga, gamit yung zero. Okay? Then, e is equals to V, ang V natin is what? May given eh. Okay, 50. So, 50 squared over 3.6 squared multiplied by G. That is 9.80 multiplied by R. Okay. So, wala tayong R. Okay. So, saan tayong makukuha yung R? Doon sa DC. Tama ba? So, ang ating R is equals to what? So, since DC yan, ang makukuha natin R is equals to RC. So, 1145.8. 916 over DC. At yung ating RC is equals to okay, 169.765 meters. Okay, so 169.765 Yan. So yung ating E is equals to okay, 0.116 Ayan. So hanapin natin yung E. Okay. So, remember, this is E and this is B. Tama ba? O kung saan yung B is equals to L. Okay, yan. Then, this is theta. Okay? And yung ating tangent, theta is equals to E. Okay? Or approximately equals to E. Ibig sabihin, ang ating E dito is equals to what? L adjacent, at, sorry, opposite over adjacent. At ang ating L is also equals to B. Okay? Yan. So, makakarap natin yung E. So, E or big E is equals to B multiplied by small E. Ang B natin is 1.75 multiplied by small E na 0.116. Okay, makakuha natin yung super elevation natin na E or elevation na E. So, that is equals to 0.203 meters. Okay. Ayan. Okay. Next, letter B. Ang pinakapanap sa B. Okay. The spiral angle at the first quarter point. Okay. So, spiral angle, hmm, that is about S. Okay. Ayan. So, at any, po, uh, at any point to. So, ang point natin is first quarter of the point. Okay. Ang spiral. Okay. So, ang equation to is what? L squared over 2RC multiplied by LC. Na kung saan yung ating S is equals to what? First quarter point. So, one-fourth of what? LC. 75. Okay? So, one-fourth of 75 
is 18.75 meters. So, ang ating S or spiral angle is equals to what? 18.75 squared over 2 multiplied by RC. Now, 169.765 multiplied by R. Multiply by LC, na 75 meters. Okay? Then yung ating spiral angle at the first quarter point is equals to 0 degrees and 48 minutes. Ayan. Letter C. Okay, determine the deflection angle at the end point. Okay, so that is I is equals to SC over 3. Okay, endpoint na kasi kay SC. So, so natin SC natin. That is equals to what? LC squared over 2 RC. Ang LC natin is 75. Ang RC natin is 169.765. So, ang ating SC or spiral angle at the end point, okay, is equals to 12. Ah, sorry. Co-convert nga pa natin sa degrees to, no? 180 over 5. So, this is 12.656 degrees. Therefore, ang ating deflection angle is equal to what? 12.656 over 3. So, ang I natin is equal to 4.219 degrees. Okay? And last, letter D. Okay, determine the offset for the tangent at the second quarter. So, offset. So, x, c. Ah, sorry, x. Pero, at the second tangent siya. Ah, sorry. At the second quarter points. So, ano nga ba equation to? x, c multiplied by l cube over l, c cube. Okay? Na kung saan ang ating l is nasa second quarter. So, that is one half. Okay? Of l, c. Okay? So, one half of 75 is 37.5 meters. Okay? Then, yung ating XC. Ang XC natin is equals to what? LC squared over 6RC. Okay? So, this is ano, 75 squared over 6 multiplied by RC na 169.765. Okay? So, ang XC natin, XC is 5.522 meters. Okay? So, ngayon, makakuha natin X. So, x natin is xc, 5.522, multiplied by L, which is equal to 37.5 cube over LC, which is equal to um, 75 meters. So, ang ating x is equal to 0.69 meters. Ayan. Okay? Ayan siya. So, mahirap lang siyang, ayan o, tag ito. Mahirap lang yung mga ano niya, mga derivation niya. Pero, once na naintindihan niyo yung derivation, okay, kung wari ito, S. Yung S natin is any point. Yung X natin any point. Tama ba? Yung XC is the offset at SC. Okay, or at the end of the uh, spiral curve. Kagayon ito, yung SC ren is the uh, spiral angle at the end of the point or at the beginning of SC. Okay? So, dapat naintindihan niyo yung derivation para madali lamang ninyong gamitin yung mga equation. Okay, so this is our example number 2 for spiral curve.